Uh, thanks everybody for coming. Here is Horizon Project Update Session. Uh, I created either part with links to my slides. I put a link to Project Update Session. On. I will add Project Onboard slides to later today. And, and in case if you want to get some stickers with Horizon mascot, you can do it. I shall stick it on the table. Okay, I'm Ivan Kolodyashny. I'm Horizon Project Tech Lead for the Stein release. So if you have any questions according to my slides or Horizon itself, please ask it. So, in case if somebody missed what is it, Horizon is Web UI for OpenStack. Um, oops. Uh, for this, uh, for Horizon itself, we support such components like Nova, Keystone, Glance, and Neutron, Cinder, and Swift. All other components are provided, are implemented as Horizon plugins, so you have to install them separately. I'm sorry, it's a bit typo, but this statistic from Rocker, Rocker release, we've got a lot of contributors from 30 companies, we've got a lot of commits, reviews, and plugins for almost all major OpenStack components like HIT, Trove, Ironic, Vitrage, and other. All Rocky features we implemented, you can find in our release notes, but I want to highlight some of them. So we added a lot of quarter related features to Horizon for in Rocky. We improve user experience on quarter panels. We add server groups and server group members quarter management last release. Also, we changed our user panel. It's now it's Angular based. It's not enabled by default, but you can enable it. Your local status config and it will provide better user experience with faster modern UI. Uh, we starting from Rocky, we support support Keystone application credentials in Horizon, so you can create credential for your application, which will be available on UI. Finally, we switch to Cinder generic groups and uh, duplicated Cinder consistency groups. So in Rocky, Cinder doesn't support consistency groups at all, so everyone is supposed to use generic groups now. Also, we added um, multi-attach support. Is this feature is partially implemented Horizon, but you can attach your volume to multiple hosts, multiple instances, only if your senior backend supports this. It was one of the most asked question feature for Cinder and Nova. It was implemented in Queens and in Rocky we support this in Horizon too. We've got several improvements on Neutron features. It's auto allocated apology support and security group per port. You can edit the roles on, per, on instance page instead of details. So it's, 
I think most important feature for users, for operators, and as I said, you can find all feature list or bug fixes we did in our release notes. Uh, please, if you de deploy a new OpenStack Cloud or upgrade, please read our deprecation notes in the release note because you can, we deprecated some config options, some was removed, so it could work not as expected if you use still deprecated config options. Not much of them, about two or three options, as I remember, but it's good to check if you have something in your local sentence. Oh, and what, what are we going to do in Stein release? Uh, we decided the last PTG that Horizon will support only the Django LTS version to ha have more updates, especially for security updates for Django. Uh, that's why for time release will su support Django 1.11 and will support Django 2.0 as experimental feature. It's Python 3 only version of Django. And we tested this, all of this version on our gates per commit. So uh, we suppose that it will work without any issues on each version. Uh, we added it experimental only because Django 2.0 is not LTS release. So with a limited capacity of the Horizon team, we can support all version of Django or, and other dependencies. That's why we decided to support LTS release. It's important if you are plugin maintainer or you have some custom dashboard in your distro. Also we going to implement curse project testing for all our supported plugins. We are working on getting CI up and working for it. There are a lot of improvements for CI in the past release and we are working to do it, do more testing in the next. So according to CI in the Rocky release, we fixed almost all our Selenium te integration tests, so you, you can run them on your cloud to verify if everything works as, as, as expected. We don't have this job on Gates now because of some issues with infra which we are trying to resolve. And I expect that this will work on Gates in watch mode in Stein release. We're trying to follow all OpenStack community goals. For the past release, it was mostly developer related goals like remove outdated test plugin, uh, but for Stein release, it's the goal to test everything on Python first, which we implemented already. So Horizon fully supports Python 3. It's important for Ubuntu for upcoming Red Hat Linux release, which will have only Python 3 by default. I think it will be next year, I'm not sure. Uh, one of the cross project goal for this release is to implement upgrade checkers for each project. So, you, for example, you, you can try Horizon up, upgrade check command to verify if your Horizon config is ready to be upgraded to the new release. And we are working to implement this in Stein 
So before upgrade or time, you'll be able to see if your local settings config file has some deprecated config options. So you'll be some warning to operators. And it'll be easier to understand if you need some ch changes on your config or not. We fully support stable policy, so pre previous config will work on the new version, but if you use deprecated options and we ch remove it from the code, it will work, but your config will not affect any Horizon code. Also, we understood that there are a lot of features that is not implemented in Horizon, unfortunately. So we talk with all pro project teams, which we got in Horizon call. It's Nova, Syndra, Keystone, Neutron, and Swift, and asked them to provide a feature list which they think it's important to implement in Horizon. Which I shared this is a part with everybody. So if your user is or operator, it's extremely important for us to understand what do you want to get in Horizon. Maybe it's some feature, maybe a bug fix, maybe performance issue. So please, if you have any feedback or what do you want in Horizon, please add few notes to this is a part. So I will know that it's important for users, operators to get this implemented. Because from our side, as developers, we don't know always how users use our product. And it's important to get some feedback from operators. Thank you. So I call that we've got this. And if you have any questions according to Horizon, it's uh, how to use it, why it, does it work or not, 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 like it's not as expected or anything else, you can reach our team by the OpenStack Dev mailing list. Please add Horizon Tech to the message title so we can find it faster and answer you. Or we are always in OpenStack Horizon IC channel to answer your questions. Uh, we covered almost all time zones. So we've got core developers in US, Europe, and Japanese time zone. So almost any time when you ask something in IC, it's a good change to get answer. We've got weekly IC meetings each Wednesday. I think we are going to change this time because some people can attend these meetings this time, but we'll discuss it later. You can ask it anything. Uh, I, I will share the slides so you can you don't need to photo everything. You can ask anything related to Horizon me directly. Akihira, he is also here, our core reviewer, or you know, person your IC or mailing list. If you are interested in contribution, please join our project on board session today and two thirty PM. <laughs> So oh, I will describe how to contribute to Horizon. How does it work? What do you need to do it? Why do you don't need to learn JavaScript to contribute to Horizon? And all the tips. That's all do I have. If you have any questions, please ask it and get stickers. Any questions? Uh, 
um, multi-factor authentication is not our, on our roadmap now, but we are okay to get this if merged if somebody provides a patch. Unfortunately, we don't have capacity to implement any every feature in OpenStack. But for now, we support multi-domain, web SSO, sign up. Okay, thanks everybody for joining.